Okay, uh, poolside interview here. I'm joined by Antti Salonen and Totti Nurmi. And the reason that I'm interviewing two players at the same time is because they took a very important decision. You had two penalty shots in this game. And uh, what do you say about that, uh, uh, that little uh, Malmo Triton goalie, Johan Fernland? He's uh, got a lot of sisu. Yeah, yeah, I think it was a pretty good, good goalie. And uh, hopefully we were lucky that we got one, one, one shot today. So the first time uh, I Ilke Hulko, he, he didn't manage to score on Fernland. Yeah, yeah, unfortunately not. It was pretty close at one time, but uh, then I think there was a uh, running out of air and, and then, then it was out, out of game already. So you had to take a decision to choose uh, a new penalty shooter and you chose uh, 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 you, yeah, yeah, you, you, you made a choice for the younger guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. well, he's a lot of energy and uh, he's a good player, so why not? Why not? So, so what did you think, Toto, when you got this assignment? Uh, well, I had made one uh, penalty shot for Johan earlier at the Triton summer camp, and uh, I knew I could make it, so I just went and made a go. Yeah. Yeah. We, we talked about that. Did you, you didn't play with the, the U21. You were coaching. Sorry? You were, you were coaching the Finnish guys who were playing the U21. Uh, I haven't ever been coaching, no. but uh, I've been playing there, yeah. So, Johan Fernlund, what did you think when you, when you had to meet him again? Uh, well, I know he's a great goalie, but uh, I came from the top and tried to get under him. He's very good going to the bottom in the penalty shot, so I had to, basically I had to get neck grip. And I got it and made a goal. So, and do you, did you feel confident that you were holding the ball far enough away from him? Yeah, yeah, that that's the <laughs> tactic. Yeah. So everybody was uh, watching you, and uh, th then you came through and got this tie here. What does that mean for the team right now in the standings? I think uh, it's uh, the points are at the moment is uh, really important to us at the moment. And uh, let's see what happens at, at, the, at the next game with police and. You didn't have quite a full team this time. You you had uh, one player more today. You had uh, Rihur Antamaki. He's a really good player. It made a difference. Yeah, he's th he's maybe the top player in the team. So he gave us confidence yeah. this time. And he's a really big guy. So that's a physical imposition on yeah. the, the opponents. Yeah, yeah, I agree. <laughs> <laughs> All right, good. Thanks very much. And uh, we'll be jo watching the next match. Your next match is against P Polisen. Polisen, yeah. Polisen, yeah. How do you feel about that one? I think that uh, it's maybe easier than Malmö, uh, but let's see. You're not taking it for granted? No, no. Uh, <laughs> okay. Thank you.